Weapons, weapons, weapons. The base game has quite a lot on its own, and yet we can never have enough. Weapon mods are what you see being released the most and always getting a lot of attention. So here are 10 of the best new weapon mods for your arsenal. This video is sponsored by Aniba.com, a fairly new online marketplace where you can get game keys and gift cards for PC, Xbox, PSN, Nintendo and much more. Check out the fantastic weekly deals with up to 70% off. Use the code ICARI during the registration to get another 3% off of every purchase. And have a fun time gaming. MWM4 is the first weapon mod we are going to take a look at. It's based on the model from Modern Warfare and offers a very huge amount of customization. There are no material options, but parts like barrels and receivers can be switched out separately. The next one is the classic pump-action shotgun Mossberg 500. It comes with some usual tactical additions to keep it fresh. Next a really big AK mod, and probably my personal favorite of this episode. Not just because I had the pleasure of actually using this in real, but because the texture style is really spot on and makes this weapon look quite real. As I said, the customization is really juicy here. There is even a pistol included for some reason, not sure why. Guess I should have read the description properly, that usually helps. Next we have a little reunion with a certain someone from Fallout 3. This someone being the 10mm submachine gun. Looks like the little fella is doing well and still is in good shape. Next for some explosive action, the Cazador missile launcher. The name is already quite interesting. I also kinda like how they put those safety labels so people know which end it fires from, like anybody would actually hold it the other way around.
There are a lot of different missile options you can use with this weapon, from EMP to tactical mini nukes. The next one goes all the way back to the Wild West, the 1892 Winchester Repeater. But the next one is way more futuristic and, you know, institutional. Air 15, yeah, I like to pronounce it that way. The seam styles for that energy weapon all look very good, but the institute one fits in the most. But back to the existing realistic weapons, the MK-17 or 20 or whatever that is, well, it's a scar. This one also has a great customization and a lot of attachments. It's always cool when you can equip several lasers at once, I call it psychological warfare. Next a really huge pistol mod, STI-2011 DVC. Well, what can I say here, if you are a fan of handguns, this gun is very detailed, has a lot of visual and functional customization and is overall very fun to use.
And the final weapon is another SCAR, quite similar to the previous mod, it's also a nice heavy gun with a good amount of customization. And this is it for this episode, the links to all mods are as always in the description below. Don't forget to endorse the mods you like, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more best new Fallout 4 mods. Thank you all for watching, and see you around!